Hey everyone, today we are back with the next part of DST with iconic queen Miss Skinny Legend Bella Ellingson and all the drama. In the last one, if you haven't seen it, go watch it, but Fiona is finally gone, hopefully for good. We sent her on a train, she's out of the country, hopefully she's never coming back with her dusty hair. Anyway, but we have one more little problem we have to tie up, which is Miss Charlotte, who we are confronting and going to take down. So we gotta see what happens with all of that. Anyway, I really, really hope you all enjoy. Give it a big thumbs up if you do. Subscribe if you aren't already for more of the skinny legend. And let's begin all the drama. The mall, my favorite place in the world. A place where after a long day in loser life, shopaholics can be themselves. A place where fashion icons like me can express themselves. A place for dreamers and credit cards. I thought after everything that happened, this trip to the mall could be all of this. Um, why do they look shook? But obviously, like everything in this story, it didn't go as well as planned, resulting in this situation. I know, you must be wondering what is happening. Trust me, it's like the worst thing that has ever happened to me. My credit card was declined! D-E-C-L-I-N-E-D. -E -E Declined. Why? Don't worry. We'll get there in a few. But first, let me put things into context so you can clearly attest to the seriousness of this situation. <laughs> this is, the fact this chapter is called Poor. <laughs> a few minutes before the tragedy. Oh, Jesse, I really needed this trip to the mall to reward myself. What do you mean to reward yourself? I got rid of Fiona for good and shut Charlotte up. Really? Yes, it felt so good. Oh my god. You should have seen Charlotte's face. Priceless. We all saw Charlotte's face. That definitely was priceless. She was just... We stomped on her. Oh, I bet it was. I wish you had filmed that, honey. What about... Well, I mean it was, if you will. What about you? How did it go with Kenny? I want the details. Well, he walked me home and we kissed. New couple alerts! And he is so cute and romantic, he even invited me to the restaurant tonight. Aw, I'm so happy he's real. I knew him since that hallucination I had last year. I remember that very iconic hallucination. And then we were stuck with Goldilocks, but now the real man is here for our Jesse. About that, I still don't understand how it's possible. Are you on drugs? I guess it's just fate, Jess. Maybe, whatever it is, I'm glad I met him. Me too, and I checked his hair. It looks 100% natural. What she really has to check for? Yes, and it's straight. No more curls drama. Yeah, Goldie can choke. <laughs> yeah, he can. He's been gone out of the story for chapters, thank goodness. Okay, enough discussion. It's time to shop, honey. Yes, we both deserve to spend money on clothes. Oh, we should take pictures of us turning on racy outfits and post them on Instagram. Yes, I'll post them on my profile. Let's do it. Sexy attitude, honey. Sexy. Oh, look at Bella. Oh, yes, sweetie. You look amazing. So fetch. Yes, oh, Bella's dropping it like it's hot. Oh, yes. Slay. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. My wig. My poor wig. Wig officially snatched. Yes, it's a yes. Love it. Uh, no, 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 not this one, sweetie. <laughs> yes, attitude. I like how the bad like, <laughs> I'm so dead at the fact he was like, no, like, not that one. Oh, yes. I love this caption, sweetie. It's, like, so fetch. I love how Jesse is trying to say this, like, make fetch happen again. It's not gonna happen, Jesse. It's the second time you say this today. Did you watch Mean Girls last night? Yeah, I did. Karen is my fave. All right, let's pay for all this, hun. We have lots more shopping to do. Oh no, that's what they think, but there's gonna be a decline here. Did you find everything you needed? No, but it's okay, I'm still taking these. Oh, okay, great, how do you wanna pay? Just the casual, like, no, it's not, but I'm buying it. I'll pay with a credit card. Okay, you can put it in. There, can you put everything in a bag, please? I'm sorry, miss, your car was declined. Oh no, I'm so scared to even hit next. What do you mean, declined? It happens sometimes, you just have to wipe it with the tissue. Oh no, oh no, oh no, it's gonna still be declined. There, it should be working. No, it's still declined. Are you sure you have enough money on your bank account? Of course I have enough money in my bank account. Your machine must be broken. <laughs> she did not know what she got herself into. Try again. It clearly says it's declined. And I will decline your cashier job if you don't try it again. All right, all right, we'll try it one more time. This is so awkward. Poor thing. Car declines. I feel bad for you, Lee, right now. Try it again. It must be a mistake. I'm filthy rich. I can't be poor, okay? Like, 
<laughs> Security, please. What? No, you can't throw me out. Don't you dare get your hands on me, you rent a cup. I am Bella Ellingston. Oh, well, that didn't help much. Oh, no, she was thrown out. It's like, I wonder why the card was declined. I swear, did her father cut her off? Oh, no, she is enraged. Declined, daddy, declined. I have never felt more humiliated in my whole life. What is happening? What if people start thinking that I'm poor? Yes, Bella, about that, we need to tell you something. <gasps> did they? What? You're frightening me. Don't tell me we're poor. Well, technically, we are not, but all our accounts have been frozen. Oh, my goodness. Our accounts have been frozen. What does that mean? Did the bank put them in a fridge? No, Bella, it means that we can't use any of the money we have. We don't know what happened yet. We called the police. They are currently investigating. They are suspecting that we have been hacked. So what? Are we poor until they find out what happened? Yes, there is nothing else we can do right now. No, I can't be poor. I refuse it. Oh, wow, Bella. Bella, are you the here? She hung up. Well, this is a disaster. So someone hacked. Why do I have a feeling it could possibly be Charlotte? But you know what? I'm not pointing fingers just yet. Well, I am, but you can't see it. But you just might in a few more chapters. Because yes, I might as well announce this now. I think on chapter, I don't know which chapter yet. It could be two chapters, three, four, five. But Face Cam is coming back for the series for the ending. You've all been asking for it, so it will be returning for a few chapters up until the finale. And any back of the story, sorry for the announcement. It's okay, let's hope the police solve this quick thing quickly. I hope so, because how's our mom gonna get, like, Botox all the time? No, my dear, you cannot dress up as a cop and seduce a detective to help the investigation go faster. Oh, well, you know what? Let her try, honestly. Like, Bella needs her money. So how are you holding up, sweetie? How does it look like I'm holding up, Jesse? I'm poor. My life is over. Oh, sweetie, I'm sure it's just a misunderstanding. You must have hope. Oh, my God. All these years despising the middle class. And now I'm a hobo. Don't say that. You're not a hobo yet. I mean, not yet, you know. You're not a hobo at all, and you'll never be. This is my karma, Jesse. This is what I get for being so fabulous. I knew it. My life was too good to be true. Look, I'd love to stay here and with you, but I have to go to class. Don't stay all alone, honey. Do something. Depression doesn't suit you, okay? I'll see you later. Ugh, I also have to go to class. I'm already poor. Let's not be uneducated. <laughs> Bella's life is such a journey. Like, she really goes through a lot. Oh, not Miss Blueberry. Please go back to Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Young lady, can you repeat me what I just said? Uh, what? Bola, are you not paying attention to my class? Oh, uh, shove it, Miss Blueberry Pile. It's Bella, not Bola. Hey, Bella, Bola means ball in Spanish. Are you a ball? Shut up. So was saying, Diego Vas Velasco, I'm gonna butcher this, I'm so sorry y'all, is probably the most famous painter of the Baroque period. Oh girl, that's funny, I once dated a guy named Diego, he was into custom cars, even had his own garage. Why did you guys break up? Well, he was so obsessed with custom that he even wanted to customize me. Oh, wow. He was like, relax, Keek. It's just a boob job. Oh, that guy had nerve. Do you know what I said? What did you say? I said, I'm keeping my boobs as they are, sir. Boom. Slammed the door and got a new booty call. Oh, that was very interesting story, Kiki. Thanks for sharing it with us. Oh, my gosh. I'm really not in the mood for their usual moronic stories. What if my life as I always knew it is about to end? What if I'm going to have to get a job? Work? Ew, no. It has to get better. I can't live like normal people. Why is this happening? Bola, are you okay? Oh, look, you have water coming out of your eyes. It's Bella, B-E-L-L-A, and no, I am not okay. Oh, no, she's poor. Ah, uh, poor girl. Maybe my story about Diego made her emotional. You know, I talked about breast augmentation where she has when she has such tiny boobies. Oh, yeah, she does have tiny boobies. <laughs> right, at first I thought she was a 12-year-old boy with long hair. Oh, no, everyone is just going on, Bella. They're going in. Your hand is like a holy place that my hand is unworthy to visit. Excuse me, who is this? If you're offended by the touch of my hand, my two lips are standing here like blushing pilgrims, ready to make things better with a kiss. Oh my gosh, it's Charles. It's our boy. Now my sin has been taken from my lip by yours. 
Aw, Charles is so cute. Then do my lips now have the sin they took from yours? Oh, she's about to go up there and do a little like duet or not a duet. I don't know what she's doing up there, but she's doing something with him is what she's doing. Oh, hey, I thought I was alone. So you decided to practice Romeo and Juliet before class? Yeah, well, it's a classic. Why don't you go on? You were great. Uh, I don't really remember where I was. Let me help you out. Then, do my lips now have the sin they took from yours? Sin for my lips, you encourage crime with your sweetness. Give me my sin back. And then it says, they kiss again. Well, <laughs> I guess we gotta do it. <laughs> it's what it says. Well, if it's in the play... Obviously, play or no play, I wanted to kiss him. It was just an excuse, but I think he knew that. We were here passionately kissing in an empty theater. Nobody else around us. Can that bird not be so rude outside? Okay, thank you. For a few seconds, I forgot what was going on with my bank account. I was feeling peaceful, so peaceful. And then, hey, why are your cheeks wet? It looks like your mascara ran. It's nothing. Are you sure you can talk to me? Oh no, she's having a breakdown or thing. I'm poor. All our accounts have been frozen. The Ellingsons are over. I'll have to probably leave soon. Wait, what? What happened? The police think someone hacked my parents, so all of their accounts are frozen. Meaning I'm poor until it's over. And they don't even know if they can get the money back. Oh, I'm sorry, Bella. I don't- I didn't know who would do such a thing. I don't know, probably. Oh, Charlotte. Well, well, I've just arrived and already hear my name in a conversation. Oh, look, it's look who the cat dragged in. Tell me, what have I done now? Oh, you know what you did, skank. Bella, what did you just call me? Who do you think you are? Look, I have no idea how you got all my accounts to get frozen, but I'll fight you. Your accounts are frozen. Okay, I see why you think I could have done that, but I didn't. Actually, don't care for money. I'm all for charity. Maybe I could give you a few cents. Keep your cents. And you're not even into charity. Stop pretending to be nice. But I am into charity. I do tutoring for deaf children. She is such a liar. No, she does not. Oh, well, if you're so into charity, why don't you make music for the deaf? I can't, Bella, Bella sis. Oh no, I can't make music for the deaf. Oh, see who's backing down now. You were such a fraud, Charlotte. And you're such a bitch. I didn't freeze your accounts, okay? Hey, chicas, calmos. Keep your energy for class. We haven't even started yet. She started it. She continued it. I don't care about that. Just stop. You are acting like, uh, right now. And on my stage, I have a saying, which is... <laughs> don't get rolls. So if you want to roll, stop being a-holes. Hey guys, I'm super hungry. We should all get dinner together. I know a super fancy place, but they only take credit card. Um, okay, so, uh, you're, mm -hmm. do they have vegan options? Of course they have that. Sounds like a great idea. Charles, Bella, are you coming? She's doing it on purpose. You know what? Just, just ignore her. We're not going to give her the time of day. No, thanks. Come on, Bella, we're all going. It would make us sisters come closer. It's so sad, Bella. Right, I'm sure you're super sad. Hey, it's okay, I can pay for you. I wouldn't mind, I have a job. No, thank you, Charles, but I don't need anyone's charity. Are you sure? I really don't mind. It would even make me happy. Yeah, go with them. You'll tell me all about it later. No, you should go with him, Bella. No, I don't want to go if you're not going. All right, guys, let's go anyway. I know a perfect Italian place. All right, I got leave. Get out of my sight, Charlotte. All right, well, I'll go back to my dorm. I'll see you. Yeah, see you, Charles. Aw, oh, Charles is so sad. We should just let him take us out for dinner. Aw, oh, she's like running to go cry and scream, I'm sure. Oh, there's Gerald. Why are y'all dressed up? Are you going somewhere? Oh, no, does Gerald know about the, the new man? What? Me? No. I can't stand being poor, Jesse. It's too much frustration. And Charlotte went to the restaurant with everyone. She knew I wouldn't be able to pay. I hate her. And because Charles felt bad for me, he didn't go either. I'm poor, poor and alone. I don't know if I can survive another day without buying shoes. Have you ever heard of knocking? We didn't ask Gerald. I am poor. I have the right to be rude. Sweetie, I know you're panicking right now, but I promise you everything is going to be just fine, okay? Have faith. The police will sort this out soon. Of course, you can be optimistic. You just found love. What? You found love? Oops. 
Oh, wow, I didn't want you to find out. Uh, I mean, to find out that way. Didn't want you to find out that way. You're going to dinner with Kenny. You're so lucky. I envy you. Who is this Kenny? Thanks for blowing my cover, sweetie. I appreciate. Oh, my God. I'm sorry, Jesse. I can't do anything right since I miss money. Don't say that. But since you sold me out, maybe you could help me pick up my lipstick for tonight. Well, I guess I can do that. All right, here are all the lipsticks that I have. Which one should I wear, sweetie? Ooh, okay, we're gonna pick. So he's wearing like an orangish one. So let's look at the orange crush. Um, well, let's look at all of them real quick. I want to see like, uh, uh bubblegum pink does not match. Raspberry, no, 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 no. Let's not do that. Cherry red. I always go for a classic red lip, but I don't know if it's gonna go with the outfit. Plum would be okay, I guess. What about Scarlet? Ooh, Scarlet's nice, but I'm actually gonna try like a different one. Okay, we're gonna match the outfit. We're gonna go with Orange Crush. You look so hot. I'm so happy for you. Glad I know you because it doesn't really show. Oh my God, maybe he'll kiss me tonight. Can you imagine? Hey, who is this guy? Do you know him? Don't kiss him on the first date. Brother, he's the man of my dreams. Let me be. What if he's a psychopath? You shouldn't go. Stay here. You'll be safer. Oh, poor Gerald. And you even have Gerald to take care of you? I have nobody. I have nothing. And there she goes. What's going on with her? She's getting worse. Frozen account. She's losing it without money. Anyway, I'll see you later. Or maybe tomorrow morning. Oh, what do you mean tomorrow morning? Jesse, come back. Don't sleep with him on the first date. You don't know him. Jesse. Well, you know what? He's gone. I'm being marginalized soon. I'll listen to punk music. Ugh, this is my destiny. I have to do hobo stuff now. Oh no, she's gonna go talk. Please don't tell me she's gonna do that. Hey, freaking frack, give me drugs. Wait, what did you just say? I said freaking frack right after that. Give me drugs, idiot. Oh my god, she's trying to become like me. I think she loves me. <laughs> oh, crackhead is always a journey. Uh, why do you want drugs? Because I'm poor now, so I need to do things that poor people do. Drugs are actually expensive, Bella. Not everyone can buy them. Oh, no, don't tell me I'm too poor to get high. I need something, Jordan. I can't survive like this. Help me. Jordan is right. Drugs are expensive, but I know another way to help you. Uh, uh excuse me, crackhead. And I would totally be ready to sacrifice myself to make out with you. Um, I know it's so generous of me. So where are we doing it? I might not actually be that desperate, crackhead. Besides, you have a girlfriend. My girlfriend? Oh my god, I forgot about her again. She must be waiting for me. Oh my gosh, never forget. So you really won't give me drugs. Look, I completely would if I didn't care about you. But unfortunately, I still care about you. So no, I won't sell you anything. Jordan, like, sweetie, like, you were... We loved you about, like, 20 chap... 30 chapters ago. And knowing you, you'll bounce back very soon. You might be right, but you know it's hard. I feel like a hobo. Oh, right. You actually are a hobo. Wow. Now I get why you smoke weed. So what do you think I should do? I think you should go to your dorm and get a good night's sleep. Well, I mean, that's always a good option to do. It's Jesse. Hey, Jesse, is everything okay? Sweetie, you'll never guess there's a few tables from us at the restaurant. Who, Britney Spears? Uh, no, it's less pleasant than that. Charlotte is there with your plant and jerk, but also with the special guest. Come on, Jesse, spill who it is. It's Byron. <gasps> Excuse me? I think they both like each other. Yeah, Ken and I think they're dating. You know what? Great. I don't care. Trash dating trash. This is perfect. Honestly, they can have each other. Screw Byron. I hate him. I know, right? I just thought I'd call to let you know. Bella? Bella, are you still there? I think she hung up. Oh, maybe she's mad about it. Oh, yeah, probably. Jesse, Jesse, can you hear me? The phone service probably got cut. No! Your phone service has been suspended because you failed to pay your monthly bill. You will not be able to use our network until you clear any outstanding balance. Oh, no. It's just one thing after the next. They, they disconnected my phone. It can't be. How can I survive without network? Oh no, she's gonna pass out. Why, God, why is this happening to me? I don't deserve so much hate. I need to call my parents. I wanna talk to them, but I can't. Wow, she really can't. Wait, I'm in a sorority. We're supposed to be sisters. Maybe they could help. Oh no, I don't think this is about to go well. Let's see if the Deltas can really help me. I don't know about this. Anybody here, it's Bella. Um, ooh, why is it, like, quiet? <gasps> why is she shook? Oh, what? What's happening with, uh, why is Tiffany crying? Tiffany, what's wrong? 
How long have you been standing there? I just arrived, don't worry. Oh, I'm sorry you had to see this. I usually don't cry in front of people. Why are you crying? Are you poor too? What? Uh, nothing. It's just, it's silly. Really, I felt like I needed to cry, so I did. But what was the trigger? What made you sad? Well, I heard that DJ found a new girlfriend. DJ, your ex, I thought you despised him. I get so, I like cannot handle like seeing my name. <laughs> I don't despise him, not really. Oh girl, don't tell me you still love him. No, I never actually loved him. It's just that he has moved on and I haven't. I just can't seem to find anyone. What is wrong with me? Hey, don't be sad about that. You'll find someone. Everybody does. I'm so tired of playing the mean girl all the time. I am unhappy, Bella. And I am poor. <laughs> it's the Rorty sisters crying together. I think I know what we need. What? Food. We're single anyway. We don't have to say skinny for anyone tonight. Here, let's eat a cupcake to celebrate our misery. Ah, I love how Tiffany and her are like friends. Like, I really thought Tiffany was going to be like evil, which I mean, I guess she like secretly is, but like, she's actually so nice to Bella. Like, who would have thought? Unless she turns on us later in the story. I don't know. Oh, I can't remember the last time I ate sugar. I know, right? It's so hard to be pretty. People just don't get it. Yes, we are completely misunderstood. People think that pretty girls never feel sad. But we're humans too. Yes, we are. Just prettier humans. Hey, by the way, what are you doing here so late? My bank account is frozen, so my phone service has been suspended. I wanted to use someone else's phone. Oh, here, you can take mine. Oh, thank you so much, Tiffany. Sure, anything for my fellow Deltas. Oh, sisters. I'll call my parents to see if they can fix the problem. Hey, Daddy, any updates? I don't think I can survive one more day like this. Bella, I actually tried to call you, but it did not work. I know, they suspended everything. Oh, I'm so sorry, sweetie. But I have good news. The police found the breach, and apparently they were right to think it was a hack. If everything goes as planned, everything should be fixed by tomorrow. Oh my gosh, sigh of relief. Insert here. Tomorrow? That is amazing, Daddy. It means that we'll be rich again, right? Indeed, sweetie. Your mother was very enthusiastic as well. That is why we have decided to spice things up and get naughty tonight. Oh no, we don't need anymore. Oh, mama is spicy. Oh no, daddy. I really didn't need to know that. All right, Bella, we are going to let you go to sleep. Well, us grown-ups do grown-up stuff. Okay, bye-bye. We don't need it. Like, no, 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 no. Okay, cool. I'm just gonna throw up. Bye, daddy. Bye, mommy. Ugh, they're so disgusting. I didn't have to know that. Well, at least they're happy, right? I guess so. And so am I. Thank you so much for spending time, some time with me. I'm feeling so much better. You're welcome, Tiffany. And if you ever need real company, not that suck up lapdog Hannah, just call me the dragging. I will. All right. Well, I think I'll go to my room. Oh, <gasps> what is going on? Is she kissing me? Y'all, I'm like speechless. Wait, is that cherry chapstick? It tastes good. I said that Katy Perry reference. Oh, wait, am I enjoying this? You know what? Just continue. Whatever. <laughs> yep, that is definitely cherry chapstick. You know what? She's in college. Let her have her fun. Whatever. Her lips are so soft and she's so gentle. Wait, that's my first time kissing a girl. Oh my God. I, this, this never happened to me before. I, uh, good night, Bella. Is Tiffany going to be a romance option? Good night, Tiffany. Oh, wow. That was a plot twist. Oh, my God. I just kissed a girl. I kissed a girl and I liked it. Wow. I guess I really need some sleep tonight. Too many things happened in one day. What an experience for Bella. My goodness. Trish, wake up. We have to go. <laughs> the way she just woke up for Trish. What? Where do we have to go? What happened? We have to get coffee and I, so I can see if my credit card works again. And let me guess, you can't do that on your own. Oh, come on, heartless roommate. I need emotional support. All right, all right, I'm coming. It worked. I'm rich again, Trish. Great. You could be more enthusiastic. Bella, it's in the morning. I don't have any class today. I just want to go back to bed right now. Okay, wait, let me check if I have service again. It's working, and you couldn't have checked from our room. I hadn't thought of it yet. You know, we really wanted to take you out, Trish. Hey, Daddy, have you seen it? We're rich again. Yes, Belle, the bank called earlier. It's all back to normal. That is amazing, Daddy, but do we really know what really happened? Yes, we've been a victim of a hack. Apparently, they tried to steal our money, but they failed. They did not even get a cent from us. Oh, thank goodness. So I'm glad this is all over. I'm probably going to go shopping to celebrate. All right, kissy, kissy, I have to go. Aw, yay, she got her money back. Who is this? Are you Bella Ellingston? Are you a weirdo? Oh my gosh! 
you're coming with me to be continued losers. What? Okay, I'm a little shook right now. Finally, Bella, like, recovered her life and isn't poor anymore. And the skinny legend just got knocked out and dragged away by a weirdo. On top of that, we had a cute emotional moment with Tiffany. Who knows where that's gonna lead? We have some more drama to throw in there, as always, in Miss Bella's life. But wow, what a chapter. That was one for the books. I mean, they really all are. But ooh, that was memorable. Anyway, I really, really hope you all enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching, as always. And I will see you next time. Bye, everyone. Delicious, yeah, girl's got style She loves all the attention Yeah, she's serving with a smile They came from heaven